So in the past month, I have played a new music concert. A packed music club. And now we're doing a sold out kids concert. Like they're really... The variety. Is there like a musician bingo that I should be made aware of? Because I might do really well at that. Peter and the Wolf. As a clarinet player, you hear Peter and the Wolf and you get excited because you get to be the cat. Meow. I'm a clarinet player, but why am I putting together my bass clarinet? Mm. Well, the school I teach at, we have two clarinet teachers, myself and another person. The other person is established. Great player. He should get the cat part. However, we don't have a bassoon player. Yeah. We're doing the wind quintet version, which has a narrator, but it's for woodwind quintet. So typically clarinet, bassoon, horn, oboe, and flute. Each instrument represents something. I. Like I said, the clarinet is the cat, the horn is the hunter, the flute is the bird, the oboe is the duck, the bassoon, or in this case, the bass clarinet, is the grandpa. I am the grandpa. So there's the title of this vlog. Now I know the idea of being the grandpa. I didn't seem too enthused by it, but the part's actually pretty fun. Because every character gets their own little musical theme. And while the cat is the one that I know and love, the grandpa one is pretty fun, not gonna lie. In other words, I'm not mad about being the grandpa. I will embrace my grandpa-ness. I am the GP. <laughs> there mainly because I'm really sick if you couldn't tell it's a Monday I've already canceled my lessons this week I was literally fine yesterday like I recorded those clips of me practicing yesterday and when I was practicing I was like oh I'm a little tingly in my throat and then it's just gotten progressively worse and now I can't breathe out of one side of my face I don't know if I'm gonna be able to be the grandpa, but I'm gonna send everybody a message because that rehearsal is not until Wednesday. And we do have a, <coughs> a second rehearsal on Friday. I just tested for COVID. I'm waiting for the rapid results. I don't think it is COVID because this would also be the third time that I've had COVID. I'm just not into that right now. So that's not an option for me. So I am going to continue watching Bridgerton from the comfort of my couch under a blanket. And, uh, yeah. A little health update. First of all, today was a stunningly gorgeous day. It rained a little bit and then the sun came out and currently there is a beautiful sunset outside. Can I enjoy it? No because I feel woozy. I feel like my brain is trying to leave my head. I feel like my sinuses are just non-existent. And I, I, I keep blowing my nose and there's just so much. Like, how is there more? Anyways, I've made the decision to not do the rehearsal tomorrow um, because I don't know if I will be able to physically play my instrument because I don't know if you've tried to play a wind instrument when your sinuses are fully clogged, but that is where I am now. I will also not be attending my wind ensemble rehearsal, which I'm really torn up about because I'm also missing next week as well. I love being a professional musician, but I literally cannot afford to get sick and sickness comes at the worst 
possible times. But I think I will be okay to play the rehearsal on Friday. I'm gonna let my quintet know. It's an unfortunate reality of, of what we do. I'm gonna be playing the concert on two rehearsals. I've done a lot more with a lot less rehearsal time, if I'm being honest. Like, I'm not too worried about it because I have played the quintet before. Not worried about it, but I just feel like my like the the insides of my face are trying to be on the outsides of my face <laughs> sorry that's really gory but that's like all i can really that's how i can describe it everything in my head hurts <laughs> oh 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 thank you thank you it's really not necessary i'm out of bed <laughs> Okay, here's your health update. I obviously did not go to my rehearsal this morning. I will not be going to my rehearsal this evening. <coughs> I can almost breathe completely out of my nose, but my nose is insanely crusty, so I'm not gonna show you. Um, just from like blowing it over and over and over again, just like so. Because I'm feeling a little bit better today, I think I'm gonna just like clean up my living area. A sick person's been living here. So yeah, I'm gonna do like a, just a little bit of tidying. Um, today's activity is just gonna be take a shower and we're gonna try to work tomorrow, I think. I feel, I feel pretty good about trying to work tomorrow, but we'll see what Colin says when he gets home. Goodness, it's my first time outside since Sunday. I tried to work today, did not go well. Now that I'm home, I want to go to bed. I tried to put some makeup on my face to make me look more alive. I don't know. I should practice my part for tomorrow, but I think I'm just gonna cross my fingers and hope for the best for tomorrow's rehearsal. And I'm gonna go to bed early tonight. There's your health update. Oh, this is such a low energy video, oh my god. I'm so sorry. Find yourself somebody who will give you noodles in bed. I am currently in bed eating ramen <laughs> that Colin made for me. Health update. I can't hear. It's early and I'm heading to a place where I need to play 100%, but I'm only gonna be able to play 90% if I'm lucky while feeling 70%. I mean, I'm at 70%, which is pretty optimistic. My contact is blurry. Oh, let's go to rehearsal. Mask check. <coughs> Ugh. What kind of room? Is it your room? I, I, have, I have my own, like, kind of It's thing. not the school's. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That was one of the roughest rehearsals I think I've ever had in my entire life. I'm all clogged up again. Ugh. I think if I was playing clarinet, it would have been a little easier, but I'm trying to like wrangle the beast and play well. And like, it does take more air to get a really good sound and more air in my condition is just not something that was possible today. So I think I played the worst bass clarinet that I ever had, and it's already a really hard part. Why did I wear a fucking turtleneck? Like, a wool turtleneck. 
on a 60 degree day. I gotta go home and rethink my life choices. The concert will be streamed, but we kind of collectively decided that under no circumstances should the stream be kept up. So I'm probably not gonna have any clips for the performance. If you like Klezmer, I'm gonna link below a great album with a Klezmer version of Peter and the Wolf called Pinkets and the Pig, and it is fabulous. I love it so much. The clarinet player who's playing with us is actually the Klezmer clarinetist on that album, so I'm gonna link that below. I highly, it is very entertaining. They also Klezmerize a few uh, like classical pieces, which is funny to hear like Mahler 5, but Klezmer. <gasps> I'm gonna get lunch at my favorite spot. Oh, and we're back on the sick couch. I thought that during this week that I would have a lot of time to like getting outside, getting the fresh air because it's not freezing. And I'm sick and I'm inside. Maybe I'll go on the porch later, but like, the place that I went to to get my lunch is one of my favorite sandwiches. Let me tell you what's in it. Actually, there's nothing on it that tells you what's in it, but it's like apple and green tomato and like some other things and like mustard. It's really good. It's vegetarian. Um, I also got, some fancy ginger ale and some fancy lemonade. Look at these tiny little pies. Like, oh my God, I can't. I was gonna get some soup, but then I got sick. Uh, it might look like I'm wearing fancy pants, fake leather leggings, CRZ yoga. Thank you, Jess. I just wanna be outside. <laughs> I am sorry, I am being such a baby for this entire video. I'm just babying it up over here. I watched Better Call Saul before I watched Breaking Bad, which was stupid. Now I'm watching Breaking Bad, and there, we're in like the tail end, I think we've got like five episodes left, and I want to watch them right now, but like I'm also watching it with Colin, so like I can't like cheat on him, but like also he wouldn't know. Waterfall. I'm yeah, doing it. Like, we had like a picnic. Love Island. Yeah. What are you doing up there? Who put you up here? It's Saturday. Wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. I just woke up. I took something last night to help with like this sinus headache that I'm dealing with. And honestly, like I am starting to get really sick of sleeping. I'm just like tired of sleeping. I never thought I'd see the day. I am just complaining even more about the amount of sleep that I'm getting. Like this is ridiculous. The first time I got COVID kicked my ass. This is clearly kicking my ass. Like I, I'm gonna fix this, hold on. All right, sick day routine. Uh, it feels like it's becoming a dreadlock. I think I'm just gonna put it up. Where is Colin? It's a Saturday, shouldn't he be home? Colin is taking a class on woodworking. They're making a bowl, but the thing about the class is that all of the tools they use are like a thousand years ago. Like they're not using any modern tools. They're, they're making a bowl out of wood with primitive, not primitive, but like with, with no modern tools. That's all I know. It's dawning on me that my concert is literally tomorrow and I haven't practiced uh, all this week because I haven't wanted to do anything to jeopardize my health. Oh my God, this feels so good. Because like the last thing I want to end up with is a sinus infection. Easter is coming up and uh, Easter is like the second coming <laughs> of 
uh, the busy season for musicians. The holiday and Christmas season is the first wave of busy season for musicians, but then I feel like Easter is like the second wave. But I haven't wanted to jeopardize those gigs over this gig. All gigs are important, but this, I mean, it's a kid's concert, like they're not, there's not gonna be a critic there. I'm definitely gonna practice a little bit today just for the concert tomorrow. I'm just doing up my laundry on this rainy Saturday and trying to get better. I mean, I've been sleeping in like it's my job, so that's one thing. Maybe I'll leave the house. I don't know where I would go. I just took something to help with the phlegm. Well, I got some fresh air today. What is it with me wearing turtlenecks on absolutely gorgeous days? I don't know what my problem is. I'm going back inside. The world is, is too much. I'm like willing myself to feel better. I just put in all the cues in my music because if you didn't know Peter and the Wolf, yeah, that's what this vlog is about. It has a narration part and the narration, the narrator I think we got is is pretty cool. Like whenever I've done this at like school functions, they always pick like the favorite teacher. So I think we got the favorite teacher. And the wolf walked around and around the tree with greedy and hungry eyes. Why couldn't I do that yesterday? It's Grandpapa. I got it, but it was the wrong D. The wrong D. There, there are two Ds. Imagine Ds nuts. A lot of this would be easier if there were fewer flats. It doesn't even sound like anything. It's a fucking D natural. It's a D natural. It's not even flat. The key change comes four bars later. Unbelievable. Like, what am I doing? as close as it's gonna have to get. It's 9.25 a.m. Chai. That's what is needed. You've seen me make it now twice in this video. I won't make this it through another one. It's concert day. The concert dress for today is black and a color. I wore a pattern because I don't have any shirts, apparently, that are a solid color. We're getting ready to leave for the concert. I need a new concert wardrobe, and actually I do have a plan for a future video that will get my concert black back in action. Like, as a professional musician, you would think that I would have a closet full of stellar black clothing, but no, I have these pants 
from 2007. I have concert clothes. They just, um, they're the most mediocre fitting things and they're, they're frumpy. I'm not gonna lie, they're pretty frumpy. We have our rehearsal with the narrator two hours before the concert. I'm gonna have a protein bar in the car. Last night we finished Breaking Bad. If anybody was wondering, the ending of a very serious TV show, like the season finale, the last season or so kind of like makes you wish that you were back at the beginning doing all the shenanigans that were fun instead of dealing with the consequences. How is this already four minutes of me talking? <sighs> Anyways, we gotta go. I just had my um, lemon protein bar. Bringing back the mask game. 2020 vibes. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear it in my voice. I am feeling a lot better. I still have a little bit of congestion, but uh, let's go in and rehearse and then perform and hopefully do okay. Normalize the gig water bottle. All black, baby. Oh yeah. And it's quiet with a straw. How fun. <laughs> wow. I've never had a chance to introduce myself. I've seen you in the hall. Celine. Car time. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I'm very pleased to meet you. You too. Yeah, because I think you're the only one switching, so we don't need... I know, I'm the only doubler here. Sorry. <laughs> if Celine waits for me, that would be great. I can wait. Yeah. Traffic is really bad. Is she coming in from the south? What? Oh. If she was coming in from the south, it was horrible. Yep. There was a double accident in the oh. tunnel. Yep. Yeah. The that Prokofiev assigns for the grandfather is the bass clarinet played by Celine. <laughs> You cannot swim. And she dove into the pond. The duck quacked angrily at the cat. Caught, the wolf began to jump wildly, trying to get loose. Well, concert's over, which means that this video is coming to an end. Thank goodness. Uh, thank you for nursing me back to health. Thank you for coming with me on this journey from sickness to almost wellness. I feel, I think you can feel the vibe of the video changing a little bit as I'm getting better, as I'm getting stronger. What does the future hold? I have a rehearsal in three days for, you'll find out, but I will say, Easter is coming. I know it'll be after Easter by the time you watch it, but I got Easter gigs up the waz. <laughs> is that inappropriate to say? Spring is here. All right, I'll see you in my next video.